following is an editorial by WVTM 13 President and General Manager Hank Price. Earlier this week, we had a story on WVTM 13 that was so important, it deserves to be told again. This White House ceremony was 47 years and 39 days in the making. Alabama's Mike Rose is the United States' newest Congressional Medal of Honor recipient. Your love for your fellow soldier, your devotion to your country inspires us all. The medal rewards Rose for his courage during a top secret mission in Laos in 1970. Serving as a medic during Operation Tailwind, Rose is credited with saving dozens of lives while suffering crippling shrapnel injuries of his own. Rose tells us he was simply doing his job. But if I had not done that, consciously not done that, I would have failed myself, my fellows in my unit, I would have failed the Army. On the last day of the battle, Rose was thrown from a crashing helicopter, but he did not hesitate to crawl back to the burning aircraft to pull the wounded from the wreckage. So despite everything that you faced and the actions that you carried out, you don't consider yourself a hero? No, sir. The, the heroes are listed on that wall, those 58,000, those are the real heroes. More than 800 Special Forces soldiers died on missions like his fighting in Vietnam. Rose said today's medal is for them. And they fought hard and unfortunately a lot of them didn't come home. And this is a way to honor all their memories. It's and salute a 22-year-old medic who risked his own life to save so many others. This has been a WVTM 13 editorial.